Angiosaurus. Its popularity continues to rise thanks to the nickname Pinocchio Rex. This name is inspired by this Asian Tyrannosaur's long and thin snout. And that was the species field guide for the Jangosaurus, I think that was called. I may have butchered it, but that's okay. A very obscure dinosaur, if I do say so myself. But yes, I was not expecting this creature to make an appearance in this game, and actually it's a really nice surprise, because we get another creature that hasn't been seen in the first game. And I love how it's something obscure rather than something extremely popular. Like, for example, everybody knows the Triceratops, everybody knows the Stegosaurus, everybody knows the Brachiosaurus. You know, and, and because of Jurassic World, a lot of people know the Dimorphodon and the uh, Pteranodon, even though they're actually called pterodactyls by the general public. But yeah, but yeah, those dinosaurs everybody knows while the... Jangosaurus, I think it is, is a much more obscure dinosaur. I really hope they put more obscure dinosaurs in this game, because I'd really like to see some dinosaurs, maybe even some species I've never even heard of. I don't know. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into the screenshots. So for the first screenshot, we have a pair of Jangosaurs walking out of the hatchery. And I gotta say, the models look absolutely amazing. They kind of look like the Albertosaurus from the first game, except they look a little thinner, I guess. And the snout is actually a little narrower. <clears throat> I don't know how big it's going to be in the game, but it looks like it might be a medium-sized predator. Something like what the uh, Metricanthosaurus or Baryonyx are, or something like that. And uh, if I remember correctly, I've been doing some research on the Changesaurus, but it's actually a... Um, a smaller relative to the T-Rex, I think it was. Yeah, I think it's the T-Rex. And, um, yeah, it's a medium-sized Tyrannosaur from Asia. I really hope they add more Tyrannosaurs aside from T-Rex and, uh, Albertosaurus. So maybe, like, Displetosaurus, Tabasaurus, Gorgosaurus. You know, it kind of looks like a Gorgosaurus. It reminds me of the Gorgosaur from, uh, uh, I think it's Walking with Dinosaurs with Justin Long. The movie, not the documentary. The movie. And, um, yeah, that, that's what these dinosaurs remind me of. But, yeah, anyway, let's move on to the next screenshot. Over here, we've got a turquoise one sniffing the ground while the light green one is just walking around and stuff like that. So I'm assuming they can be in pairs and stuff like that. And I guess that's about it. I don't know. But the background is just gorgeous with the mountains and the trees. I know I keep complimenting the background, but it's... Can you really blame me? Because it is beautiful. And, yeah. But what you got here is the, um... The Gengisaurs. They're just, you know, chilling and stuff like that. And, yeah. Let's move on to the next screenshot, and you'll see why I think they look like the Gorgosaurs. And in the next screenshot, you've got the two Jangosaurs possibly hunting for prey or something like that. Maybe a goat or something. And basically, yeah, see the body structure on the side? It makes them actually look like Gorgosaurs, especially the one on the front. You know how it looks like a Gorgosaur with the narrow jaw and the, um, the skinny body structure and all that stuff? Looks really cool in my honest opinion. Like... But let me know what you think of it in the comment section down below. And for the last screenshot, we've got the Jangosaurus roaring, which looks really cool. This is a really cool... I might even have this as my desktop background. I don't even know. But yeah, let me know what you think of the Jangosaurus in the comment section down below. And there's another amazing shot of the background with the, um, with the mountains and the trees. Another amazing shot. But yeah, like I said, let me know what you think of it in the comment section down below. And yeah, that's going to have to wrap it up for today's video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. A very obscure but very welcome addition to the um, 
Jurassic World Evolution 2 game. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. So long!